All right, hi everyone. Since like last time, I didn't upgrade the bootloader or fix the bootloader of my TFT 35V2 uh, screen for my 3D printer. So I wanted to do it on camera for the first time. Um, here you can find the, the GitHub about uh, the, the touch screen and, uh, and uh, the bootloaders. Uh, if you click, uh, if you go into bootloader, you will be able to download the uh, the one that is for you. And uh, when you download it, you will have the Fly MCU program uh, provided with the bootloader.hex. All right, so. This is the, the instruction, basically, how you have to do it. So don't click on the link uh, because uh, uh, FlyMCU is downloaded, as I said, in the provided with the, the other file. All right, so you have to connect your TFT display. Added it. So there, there it goes into um, uh, the USB of my computer and uh, basically I wanted to do it with the, an uh, Arduino uh, Uno but uh, I don't know how this works really really so maybe there was some library you have to load and, uh, and stuff so I bought a cheap CH340 and connected it like so for the TFT thirty five V two. Again for my for my shit. Install uh, the driver, alright, so when you plug the device in Windows eleven, the the product is already uh, set up working perfectly, so it should be working. It download the driver it downloaded the driver by itself so then you have to run uh, I run the fly MCU in administrator uh, go into port uh, or an import it will refresh choose the one uh, so your USB serial CH3 all right uh, you can also do it with a what did they say um, some other name. Um, there it goes. This thing, or similar. All right. There you have the. The you have to download over here. And uh, you can download it uh, way on the right. Download. All right. Um. So yeah, uh, go back into the, the, the program. So execute it as uh, administrator. Uh, go look for your file. Uh, port, all right, as I said. Uh, then you have to check run after ISP complete. Uh, it will also verify. Uh, you have to check both of these. Uh, box. Just your correct USB connection, and then you have to. That's the step I'm in. Uh, reset the display. So I only connected it. It displays this as usual. And uh, how am I going going to do this? I have to. What did they say? Hold the connection and press the reset button then the screen will turn white. So I have to, I will try to do it with my um, thing that, this, um, that's what I got on hand. All right, also the, did it work? 
Nope. What is happening? Yeah, all right. It wasn't touching the first time. So there, solid white onto the TFT display. That's what we they they want us to do. And then start ISP. It will do its shit and it will be complete. All right, we have to to get the Complete. Screen is restarting. Uh, okay. What do I do? Hi. Did I check everything? Um. Yeah, it's exactly as it should be. Let's restart the display. I don't know. Okay. So maybe a, a new, um, yeah, it, it's exactly the same, right? I got the same message. Yeah, it's exactly the same. Flash ROM thing two dot two. All right, so maybe I got the to update the thing now. Uh, meaning, uh, uh, bootloader is maybe fixed. Probably right now. But now you have to maybe uh, update the TFT display, so where, uh, VMware update, uh, so uh, this is usually done by uh, via the SD card, maybe it's the only way, and uh, before uh, with the corrupt uh, bootloader it wasn't updating correctly. So my one is a uh, big three, uh, big th big three tech. Where can I get the firmware for it? Uh, bootloaders. T V two hold on there it is V two dot O dot twenty seven APPA one V two so all right so what they said is um check your chip your chip and if it starts with a, for me it's STM, so the right one is not this one because it, uh, this is for a chip which start with GD. So STM is this firmware. Click on it, um, download it. All right, download. Yeah, and uh, I'll see if it works. Maybe I should get a somewhat texture pack. I don't know how they. Where are these? Yeah, somewhere. Choose your texture pack as well. Choose your language thing. I'll see if it works. If this video is posted, it means it works. All right, see you.